Hi, Danny here, and welcome to this overview video on how to set up your Amazon Associates account. Um, real quick, uh, I want this video to be, be kind of short and, act and, and valuable, so I'll just go over this kind of high level. And really what Amazon Associates is, is a program that you can earn affiliate sales from by using a unique trackable ID link uh, for any referred products that you would send to your customers. So, for instance, if I have a book and um, it's on Amazon, it's on Kindle, um, I can use uh, my tracking ID to point people to get that book. And if they purchase that book, I can get a commission for it. The great thing about Amazon Associates is that even if the pe people that I'm referring don't buy my book, but they happen to buy something else from Amazon, I'll still get a commission for it. So it's a kind of a win-win when you look at it that way. Now, before we get started, um, I just want to point out there is one uh, sort of caveat for um, Amazon Associates. It's more of a requirement uh, to be compliant with their terms of service. Um, essentially, what that what I'm talking about is a website. And so, uh, if you click on the account settings here in the upper right hand corner, you'll see in your account information there's some information here, and then the basic inf account information. Then there's edit your website list. So essentially you need to have a domain, uh, a website that you own, a platform that you own in order to uh, use referral products for um, for your Amazon Associates account. Um, so if you own your own website for your publishing business or products business, you would use that site uh, that you have set up for that business and associate with your uh, Amazon Associates account. So click on edit your website list and you type in mysite.com, whatever your site name is, and then click add website. So that'll associate uh, your Amazon account with that. You can have multiple sites as well. Uh, so it's um, not a big deal if you have more than one site. Um, you go back to account settings. Um, now just to, just to kind of review that now, you can have multiple sites. I personally haven't done it, so I can't speak to how that really works, but um, you can give that a shot, but uh, as long as you have one website there, that, that'll help um, establish your account. And then when you actually look to start setting up uh, campaigns, what you're going to want to do is, is basically uh, look here in the upper left corner, the tracking ID. So tracking ID is basically a unique identifier that you can create and associate with a particular link. So I'll give you an example. If I have five different books and I'm running uh, you know, a promotion or some sort of um, paid advertisement campaign for each one of them, I want to make sure that I can segment the tracking for each one of those rather than just lumping them all into one tracking ID. That'll help me determine what campaigns, which campaigns are performing better, uh, which ones are not, and take you know, take the necessary action based off of that. So and you click on manage here. And when you click on manage, uh, you'll be able to add a new tracking ID. And then you can pretty much call it whatever you want as long as it's available. Um, you know, you click search and, and it'll automatically add it. And then you can use that tracking ID anytime you, uh, you basically set up um, a short link or a, or a, a regular uh, Amazon Associates uh, referral link and uh, it will associate with the ID that you specify. So that's uh, beyond the scope of what we're talking about here. This is just initially how do you get the uh, the account set up and how do you get the tracking ID set up. I uh, hope this, this helps at least get you started with uh, considering Amazon Associates and um, we'll look, in, look towards the future. I'll be putting out some other videos as far as how to uh, set up the tracking link for your book and, uh, and put it in uh, tracking software in order to get a good idea uh, as to you know, where your traffic is coming from and how to segment that. Um, so hope, I hope this helps. Thanks.